Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Kinesthetic and I'm here with you guys today with a Pretty Little Thing try on haul. I have purchased so many things from Pretty Little Thing lately and I decided to share them with you guys so that you guys can start preparing your cards for Black Friday. So if you guys are interested in seeing what I picked up from Pretty Little Thing, then keep on watching. So before we get started, I just wanted to address my hair and my lipstick. So today I tried a twist out in my hair. I have not tried a twist out in ages and I don't know how I feel about it. So comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of this twist out that I did in my hair. And my lip is one of the Sephora liquid lipsticks. This one is in the shade 24. I like it. I think it's a cute look all together, but comment down below let me know what you guys think. And also, before we get started, do not forget to subscribe to my channel by hitting that red subscribe button down below. As well as giving this video a big thumbs up if you guys like this video. If you guys like Pretty Little Thing, if you guys like my try-on hauls, then go ahead and hit that big thumbs up so that I know what kind of content to keep providing you guys with. And with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. So the first item that I picked up from Pretty Little Thing is this Emma Green bodysuit I think this is so cute in case you guys do not know I am a Taurus I was born in May so my birthstone is emerald so anything that's emerald green automatically catches my eye I thought this bodysuit was so cute I have been loving these little lace detail bodysuits so I definitely had to pick this one up this one was $35 so the only thing with this bodysuit was that the chest area was see-through so what I did is I threw on my Hollywood Beauty cover-ups. I wear them in the shade dark and I featured these in my August Favorites video. I love, love, love these because if you're wearing anything that's a little bit too revealing in the chest area, it does a good job of covering them up and making them look like your skin tone at the same time. They are very comfortable so I threw them on with this bodysuit. The next thing that I picked up were these sunglasses. I don't really wear like round sunglasses so I thought these were really interesting. I specifically love the detail on the side um these were $15 and I like them I feel like they are a complete vibe so the second pair of sunglasses that I picked up were these black rectangular frame glasses I think these are so cute I don't have anything like these so I definitely had to pick them up when I saw them so these sunglasses were $18 and I really really love them so the next thing that I picked up was this gold tie front knitted top this top was $28 and the first thing that I thought when I saw it was bathing suit cover-up. I think this is so cute, so dope. This is how it looks when you tie it up in the front. It is cropped. And if you're feeling spicy, what you can do is drape it over your shoulders and make it a nice little calm tee. So the next thing that I picked up is a sweatsuit. So the top is a crop black hoodie. And in the front it reads, pretty little thing. And the pants are these joggers. They have a stretchy waist. And on the left leg, it reads Pretty Little Thing in colorful print. They did have the corresponding top to this with, like, the colorful wording. And they had the corresponding pants to the top, which had the white Pretty Little Thing words along the leg. But both of the matching pieces were sold out. So I was like, all right, we're going to make this a look, okay? So this is how the hoodie fits. The hoodie was $35. And these are how the pants fit. The pants were $30. But I think this set is so cute. This is definitely a cute airport outfit. This is definitely what I wore to the airport when I went to Iceland. But I think it's so cute. So the next piece I picked up was this red ruched shirt dress. I think this is so cute. This is probably my favorite piece from the haul. I don't know. It's just something about red. And also, I feel like it gives a great shape since it is ruched and it also has a tie around the waist. This dress also comes in an emerald color and a cream color. I'll tag all three of them down below so you can see how each color looks. But I definitely like this. And I also like it because it has this zipper on the side. At first, I was like, oh, this material usually doesn't stretch. And I also have an awkward shape. It's definitely comfortable. And I would probably just pair it with like some plain black pumps. Wear it to somebody's holiday party. Drop them invitations down below. I feel like I just needed tops to like just throw on when I'm running out the house to run some errands or do something real quick and I don't want to be too cute. So I got this stone colored sweater. I thought this was really cute. The sweater was $25. And I love how these sleeves look when you roll it up. Y'all know how I feel about sleeves by now. If you are not a stranger to my channel, if you are, then make sure you are subscribed. But yeah, I like this sweater. It's really comfortable and it comes in tons of colors. So if you're looking for like tops, 
tops to add to your wardrobe just to throw on and head out the house this winter. And I would definitely recommend these sweaters. They are comfortable. And I think the price is good. $25? Hmm. So I also saw it in a neon color. And I thought it was the same thing online, but it wasn't. Um, this material is way stretchier than the one on the stone one. The stone one is more of like a traditional sweatshirt material. This is more of an elasticy um shirt material more cotton um so yeah i got this one this one was also 25 dollars so this is how it looks on and i just I, I don't know i feel like there's a lot of stuff going on that i'm not used to i don't like this neck piece it's just loose like it's just there and then it doesn't have much of it here for me to like roll over or anything it's just loose it makes me look like i had a fat neck and i now lost weight in my neck um the material is very wrinkled which means that even though i do iron it it's probably gonna get wrinkled throughout the day so yeah i definitely prefer the material on this sweatshirt and also the neckline i definitely will be ordering more colors in this sweatshirt and then this shirt i don't know and then i did also order two hats this is really noisy it is irking me but this hat was $6 and I thought it was a cute hat that I could use like when I'm making like my Christmas videos but obviously not because this thing is really noisy. I think the hat is really cute but yeah it's really noisy. So the next thing that I picked up was this neon green beanie. I feel like it's not showing off the same color as it is in person. It looks more mint green on camera but Hopefully, when you click on the picture on the Pretty Little Thing website, you can see the true color of it. But I think it's a really bomb color. I feel like it's hard to find a beanie this color. Like, it's truly neon green. I picked up these key sunglasses in the color silver, as it's noted on the Pretty Little Thing website. I think these are so bomb. I love this style of um glasses from key these are the desi times key high key sunglasses and i love them since they came out and when i found out they were on pretty little thing and they are included in the 40 percent off i said girl definitely gotta rack up i already have the black ombre ones and i have the olive green ones so these are my third pair and then the last item that i picked up were these navy blue jersey leggings these were ten dollars and i just got them because one thing that i do like is that they have this roll down detail at the top and i just wanted to see how pretty little thing leggings like what the quality of it was just to see if i need to get more leggings from them because i have been in a leggings mood this winter so far so those are all the things that i picked up from pretty little thing lately comment down below let me know which one was your favorite let me know your thoughts and your opinions on anything that was featured in this video also let me know if you guys plan on adding any of these items to your car for future purchases and thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you guys like this video, make sure you are subscribed to my channel and you give this video a big, big thumbs up. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you.